Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad Wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam Amma ba'da habita fillah Allah the Almighty says Fi kitabi al-kareem Wa fa'alu al-khair la'allukum tuflihun Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says And do good in hopes that you will be successful. And I want to encourage myself and my brothers and sisters in Islam, and in fact, anyone and everyone who is listening and willing to help, that one of our beloved brothers, Jamil Graves, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless him, and preserve him and cure him Amin Ya Rabbil Alameen somebody who's beloved to me someone who loves the sunnah of the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam someone who wants good for mankind and has been a beacon of light in the lives of many this beloved brother has run into difficulty with some debt that he has accumulated here in the kingdom of Saudi Arabia and for that reason he has been imprisoned and I just found this out and at the same time as another test of his faith and another trial for his family to try their best to overcome and confront is that he has just been diagnosed with cancer with a type of colon with colon cancer from what I understand so he is in dire need of assistance the least you can do is supplicate on his behalf and ask Allah to make his affairs easy and good and increase his risk and protect him and his family and cure him I mean you know the and what is even better than that is to supplicate and spend your money in the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The Prophet alayhi salatu wasalam said in a hadith, Al-Qudsi, that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Anfaq ya ibn Adam, unfaq ilayk. Unfaq ilayk. The Prophet وسلم, said that Allah the Almighty said, Spend, son of Adam, and I will spend upon you. Letting us know that every dollar, every real, every pound that we donate to assist our beloved brother during this great trial and tribulation that has befallen him, and this test, that you will be rewarded and Allah will spend it upon you. And the Prophet والسلام, said in a hadith, in the hadith of Ibn Umar, radiallahu ta'ala anhuma, and Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam aqal, al Muslimu akhu Muslim, la yadlamuhu wa la yuslimhu. من كان في حاجة أخيه كان الله في حاجته ومن فرج عن مسلمي كربة فرج الله عنه بها كربة من كرب من كربة يوم القيامة ومن ستر مسلم ستره الله يوم القيامة متفق عليه. This is the hadith of Bukhari and Muslim. The hadith where the Prophet Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم said. The Muslim is the brother to the Muslim. He does not oppress him. He does not surrender him to his enemies. Whoever assists his brother, then Allah will assist him. And whoever helps a Muslim out of a difficulty, then Allah will remove a difficulty for the person who does that from the difficulties that will be experienced on the Day of Judgment. Whoever covers the fault of a Muslim, 
Allah will cover his fault on the day of judgment. And this is in Bukhari and Muslim. The texts are clear and the texts are countless. From the Kitab Allah wa Sunnatul Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Inna Muslim, inna Muslim, inna Verily, the Muslims are brothers. So, if we want to show truly that we are beyond lip service, that we're beyond just speaking on our tongues, beyond just quoting hadith and ayat, then it's time to spend. And if you want Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to remove some harm from you in this life, and assist you in the hereafter and in this life, then you will assist your brother with eat, with sacrifice one cup of Starbucks to help and assist our brother during this great trial and tribulation. And I'm not one to usually ask, but I am asking this time on behalf of this brother who doesn't know that I'm asking. And we ask that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala makes his affairs easy, increases his risk, and blesses us to have people to assist us when we have a need. And may Allah make all of his affairs easy and release him from uh, prison immediately and increase his risk and help him and his family. Ameen ya Rabbil Alameen. And I will put attached to this video the contacts that I have, uh, which is a GoFund, uh, GoFundMe uh, account on behalf of the brother, and people are donating, and the goal is $15,000, and so far it seems that $4,800 have been raised, so I encourage myself and my brothers and sisters to spend as Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has commanded us to spend and as we know sadaqah is a proof in burhan and that it will uh, assist you and it will not diminish your wealth but it will only increase your wealth and increase your status with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and for evil and forgive our evil wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam